Hey folks, how you doing today? Um, I figured I'd make a video just kind of to kind of discussing things about you know where we are, you know, with the you know the economy and just you know business in general, but just really give you a good idea of you know you know what I do with Montgomery Twenty Three Twenty, and you know on a on a regular basis when it comes to you know essentially bringing value to my clients and and not just my clients but business associates and just those over the years. And what I was going to do today was, you know, last year I wrote a, I wrote a um, letter called what, you know, what are the economy is going on? And I wasn't going to kind of go over that, but you know, and it was, this was before I wrote this, I wrote this before, you know, um, chat GPT popped out in November. And I, so I wrote this probably about, I think it was like October, September of 2022. And, you know, use no, 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 no large language models or anything, no, no AI to write the, write the paper. But I, you know, I described a lot of the things that we're, you know, we're going through, through, you know, a lot of the research and everything that we've been doing here on this end and so forth. But um, it's all coming to fruition. It's exactly where we're at. But I really don't want to really get into that. Um, I made the paper available. I published it last year. <clears throat> Also, I offer it for free. You know what I'm saying? You can get it for free. You know, whenever I just put a link in the, you know, down below and everything. So that way you can get it whenever you want to. But it's, it's very, it's very interesting to, for us to be on the same page. That's when I wrote it. I wrote it with the intention of getting those around me and those that I were involved with on the same page. It's so important for us to be on the same page as a business. And just to give you a little insight on what I do and what I bring is, you know, for the past several years, everybody in Annapolis who, who's known me, dealt with me, we've had meetings, we've had engagements and everything over the past few years. One thing that I don't know if all of them or very many of them realize, but every time that they've seen me in person, I actually had to drive, you know, two, three hundred miles in order for them to be in the same physical premises of me at the time. You know, and we did this time and time again because it's part of my process and everything, you know, and I, you know, I come to serve and I come to provide and, you know, so forth. I make no bones about it. But as I look back in reflection, you know, after years of doing it, I understand that that's not normal, but that is normal for me. That is normal for the drive that I bring to those that I deal with. That is, that is for me that, you know, the value add, I go above and beyond and I don't, I don't overthink the, the, the hardness of it. So that's why when I talk to people, you know, especially for a time such as now, this is a very serious time. And what people need from me is for, they need, they need serious. Let's just be honest. I mean, let's be honest. Every day, turn on the news is something that we need serious. We need people that we can trust and depend upon that are going to take us serious. They're going to take our business serious. They're going to take, you know, what we're doing serious. And so that's, that's what we, you know, bring, you know, from Montgomery 2320. But you know, this is not a commercial. This is just, you know, just a, a little conversation about the state of affairs, you know, and where we're at. Where we're, you know, when I'm talking to people now, I'll give you a little insight of what I'm saying to people now. I'm saying you got to be able to hold your breath for the next, you know, 18, 24 months. You know, from now, you know, you got to be able to build, invest, you know, build your brand, build your table without making any money. For the next 24 months, you have to be able to invest. You have to be able to build, not just, not just, you know, it's nice to get to know everybody, but you got to build your brand. You got to build the foundation of the thing that you're building for the future. You know, we just had a um, seminar back in July, you know, and, and, and the theme was, you know, future facing business. And so future facing business, you know, what do you, you know, you know, do, do you understand what's going on in order to make your business a future facing business? You know, do you understand what's at play? You know, from government regulations to technology, you know, to, you know, on the national, you know, local, you know, you know what's going on in your local politics. Do you know what's going on in your local, you know, precincts and vicinities? Do you know what's going on? I mean, do you know what's going on on a global scale? All these things are important. I don't care what the business is. One thing that we've learned over the past few years, every business has been disrupted. There's not one business that has not been disrupted anywhere in the world. Because we're going through a shift, you know, and that's one of the things that I covered, you know, in the letter, which the letter is more powerful today than it was a year ago, you know, 
But the fact of the matter is, is this is one of the things I covered. You know, we're going through a, a you know a global economic shift. So, you know, I am very emphatic about you know conveying this message to people. I can't sugarcoat it. You know, I can't sugarcoat it. You know, if 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 you know when I'm talking to people, they're like, you know, you're really passionate. What? <laughs> Well, I'm not supposed to be. I mean, here's the reality. You know, this is serious. This is serious. You know, we're going through a total reconstruction on a global scale. This happens. This is cyclical, though. This is not new. We've, this is not the first time we've done this. It's not the second time we've done it. It's not the third time we've done it. It's not the fourth time. This is cyclical. But here's the thing. They are so extreme and so major. Where are you at? You know, where are you at? You know, where are you, you know, I mean, everybody's trying to find, you know, the easy skate. Hey, here's the thing. There's a lot of opportunity now. The problem is most people are stuck trying to do the same old things, trying to learn the same old ways, you know, fighting against the grain. You know, here's the reality. It's not about whether you like AI or not. It's here. It's been here for years. You know, we've had a smartphone for 16 years. We've all had a smartphone. We all have a smartphone. I'm filming this right now on a smartphone, you know. Guess what? It's a foregone conclusion. Get past that. You know what I'm saying? It's not about whether you like social media or not. Foregone conclusion. You know, Facebook's been around since, what, 05? You know, 05 is almost 20 years old. It's 18 years old. I mean, it's, it's an adult now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, at this point. You know, get over it. The, bo the bottom line about it is it's part of our system. It's part of our social economic system. It's part of our structure. It's part of our culture. You know, a lot of people are, I don't really like... This is not about life. This is about the world that we live in now. We've gone from the Flintstones to the Jetsons. I've been telling people this for years. We've gone from the Flintstones to the Jetsons. We're now officially, officially in the Jetsons. You know, we're now officially in the Jetsons. You know, I saw um, a meme last year. <laughs> and I think I, I saved it somewhere. But it showed that um, 2022 was the year that um, George Jetson was born. <laughs> I said, I said that's, that's funny. But, you know, take that to heart, though. You know, we're in the Jetsons now. We're in the Jetsons now. So it's time to take your business to that level. If you haven't started a business, you better get it started. This is not the time for him hawing around. But if you got a business, here's the thing. My whole, you know, when Montgomery 2320, my focus is business owners, entrepreneurs, business leaders. The head, the head, the head folks, you know, the, the people who run the organizations. That's my focus. You know, my whole thing is, you know, and that's why I come in hard because it's supposed to be hard because these are the people who need, you know, leaders need someone that they can talk to, someone that they can work with, that, that's working with them on their on their level, and not just on their level, but who can actually speak in terms that they need to hear. Leaders don't need to hear all the fluff. Leaders don't need to hear, you know, you know, the breaking news stories. Leaders need solid information. They need facts. They need, you know, due diligence. They need, you know, expert input, you know, not just opinion and conjecture, you know. So Montgomery 2320, you know, we, you know, helping leaders lead better. That's the focus. So when people come around, hey, you know, here's the thing. Here's the thing. You know, I, you know, your organization is your organization. You know, I'm not the person that you want in your organization dealing with all your people. No, I'm here for you. I'm here to deal with you because here's the reality. My, my whole thing is to empower you to be the better you you can to deal with your organization and deal with all the people in there. Because here's the thing. I'm a hammer. I'm a hammer. So when you, when you, when you get involved with me, know you're getting a hammer. You know, I'm not a screwdriver. I'm not a pair of pliers, you know. I'm not, a, I'm not even a mallet, you know, a soft head mallet. I'm not even a mallet. I am a hammer. What does that mean? I hammer down. Every, to me, everything is a nail, period. And my whole goal is to drive that nail, to secure that, fix that two by four to that two by four behind it, you know, to fix it there in that spot onto the next one. Keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it. That's what, that's, that's what I do. That's what I bring. And so the reality of it is that's a lot more than a lot of people can handle their stomach. But see, those people that can't handle their stomach are not the leaders. This is why my focus is on the leaders. 
This is why my focus is on the entrepreneurs. This is why my focus is on the business leaders and, and, and the executives, because here's the reality. These are people who require hammers. You know, they require other people to have tools. That's why we employ other people that have other tools that they use, you know, in order to build an organization and to structure our organization. My job, my job, my job, due diligence. I study everything that has to do with business, which is everything. You know, everything business related across the global market, across the global spectrum, you know, constantly, fervently, hours a week, hours a week, hours a week, not just for senseless and mindless, you know, soaking in enough information, but to, you know, to, to know what to apply across the industries, across the industries, so that I can bring as much value to the individuals who leave the industries. You see, so my, my goal is to help leaders lead better. My goal is not to sugarcoat it and to, to, to dumb it down, to, you know, to, to placate. No, you know, in a timely manner, leaders need information fast. Leaders need information now that they can take and apply, you know, inside of their company, inside of their business now or not. Just maybe, maybe they just need some insight. Maybe the clarity that they get is not to move something right now. But maybe to move it later. Whatever you do with it, you do with it. But Montgomery 2320 Business Development Services LLC is here for you. That's what we do. You know, like I said, this is not a commercial, but, you know, here, take it like it is. The reality of it is, is, you know, this is a time. It's 2023, 2024 is upon us. The year is going to end. It's going to be rough, folks. It's going to be rough. It's going to be rough. I'm just going to tell you right now, it's going to be very rough. The next 24 months is going to be brutal. But for those who can build their brands, for those who can maintain, you know, hold the line and really start to structure their businesses in a future facing manner. Hey, you know, we're going to, you know, the opportunities are going to be, you know, endless. But you got to start. Well, here's the thing. I'm, I'm hoping you've already started building. You know, if you haven't already started building, sure, I can help you. But here's the thing. It's going to be a lot harder on you because I'm going to cut through the whole, you know, the minutia of why you're taking so long to do what you need to be doing. And we're going to get right to it because I already know. I already know. I've been building a brand for over seven years and I know it's going to take at least 10 years for it to pop, you know, for it to pop. You know, I didn't know that seven years ago. I probably wouldn't have started. <laughs> but I know now, seven years later, you know. That 10 years, okay, 10 years, been building a brand, been building a brand. Okay, we're on the right track. We've made a lot of headway, a lot of brand building, a lot of brand awareness. You know, we're getting a lot of awareness from all over the place. You know what I'm saying? When I say all over the place, I mean globally. You know what I'm saying? Places I can't even, you know, provide, you know, <laughs> stuff. But, you know, but we got the exposure. We, You know, the brand, the brand is developing massively. You know, we have an SEO, we have a... You know, we have a we have a global footprint that's second to none. And this is before we even are able to capitalize on the business. But we're building the brand every day, day in, day out, day in and day out. I'm like this. If I know what I know now, if folks aren't even started, I don't. Even, whew, God bless you. Just get started, please. But for even those who have been started and established. You can't be asleep right now because a lot of businesses that have been started and established and running and operating for years are fixed to close. You know, bottom line, if they didn't close through 2020, you know, you're going to be closing soon because you're not running operations. You know, I know for a fact I can walk into anybody's business right now and run their business. That's what I bring to the table. I know I can do that. I know I can do that. Give me a few minutes to learn, the, you know, read your manual, learn your, you know, your operations, I come in, source out the area. I don't care what the business is. I don't care what the business is. I can run the operations. I know that. That's what I bring to the table. So in saying all of this, you know, let's get it together, folks. You know, like I say, get my paper. It's a quick, easy read. It's not a long paper. It's you know, two pages, you know, three pages. You know, it's, it's, it's more solid now than it was even then. It's something that you got to really implement into your thought process when it comes to building and developing your business. When it comes to even living, you know, the paper really covers, you know, like I say, you know, what in the economy is going on. I mean that that touches all of us everywhere. So, 
you know, God bless you, you know, and, and, and I didn't make this video to come in hot. If I sound like I'm coming in hot, but hey, it's necessary. You know, it's necessary for times such as this. Talk to you guys later. God bless you.